this is Victor and in this video I'm going to share to you how to prepare your own wash and why you have to do that uh, sometimes we need a color a wash with a color that we we don't have or we need to do a wash with a color that does not exist for example this hair here is done is done with a wash and I had to use like a, a different blue I will I was not using of course um, what you call this, a sermon blue, it's too dark so I wanted a lighter blue and I prepared my own wash so here I'm going to show you how to do it by painting these schools I know that normally you, use, you can use Agrax L shade, Reichland, Fresh shade or Seraphine Sepia but this time I'm going to show you how to prepare your own wash in case you run out of uh, Agrax L shade or uh, yeah or just in case the, the same the same technique is applied to prepare any wash. So we put here the the, the palette and let me just zoom out a little bit because I'm too close. Okay. So this was the mentor I was showing. Okay. Before. Now we are going to use Agrax Air Shade to do this wash. So we take a little bit of Agrax Air Shade and we put it on our palette. Okay, that's more than enough, and I think I put too much even. Because you need very little t um, ink, or I would say pigment to do the wash. Okay, next I'm going to use, um, here this Lamia Medium, okay. And I put it here next to, because I can then put more times. I realize that I, you have to be careful not, the brush was not completely clean. And you don't want to contaminate the menu. Okay, this should be enough, and we mix it. But we are going to do a last step. You see, now the texture it is still quite consistent. So I'm going to make a little bit more of the texture. So this will be good for painting, indeed. So I don't know if I have something to paint on top. Let me see if I have something here where I can show you. So this texture. If I apply it here on the shoulder pad, it's a little bit, it's, it's almost like a glaze now, okay? Okay. Very transparent. But now, the last step that I will do, is I will add a little bit of water. Hop, water. We test it. This is the texture we want. You see, it goes into the into the, uh, the wrinkles of my we can uh, to be fair let's start first with a part that have a lot of texture like here and we test it and you see it goes where it has to go and here we have okay maybe this was a little bit too dark using Rhinos height but this is the texture we want okay but I think for the purpose of this tutorial, this is how we want it to do. Okay. You see that it's working like a wash. So why I use washes is because it's much easier than preparing your own wash each time. Okay. But you can see that this also works and then we can clean it here out we have and to be fair this don't have the same type of detail that other schools have so 
how to prepare your own wash. So this week I'm going for something fast, just how, just to show you how to do your own wash. Here we can, for example, do the wash all over this. Okay. This way wash is a technique and a type of paint at the same time. Okay, here we have. And this was an, a fast one as well. Yeah, this week I go for a fast tip. Just how to prepare your own wash when you don't have the wash. Don't need to stop painting. Just do it. Just take a, a dark color, mix it properly and do your own wash and yeah I'm thinking I will need to prepare a light grey wash for one of my meters so this is the way I do it when the color is not existing so here you have and this can be even thinned down a little bit more so this was but it, it's working quite well so you can use it really for, for what I was doing I can I have to use maybe a lighter brown for the bones but just was for as a example how to prepare your own wash and now uh, I will show you once this dry how it's looking like so yeah let's wait until this dry and then I show you how it looks like so yeah the wash now is dry and this is how they look like so it's not too bad okay so this is a way to have your own wash uh, it's okay for me as a base it will be good enough but this is just, I want to show you how to do your own way. So please like, share, subscribe and subscribe it. This week I went for a short one and just I was preparing some of them before I was leaving from my studio. That's all for now, as usual. Thanks a lot for watching and see you again later. Bye!